Go around, we're gonna take a look. Ear gorge. Attacks from the back. As an eagle, we'll be showing you guys covering all the attacks from the back. I have a couple that I need to add to make sure that you guys have access to all the knowledge that we have. So we're gonna begin with the one that I love. And I do it a lot. You know, a lot of times when you work and try to get the collar, the guy keeps defending. I do it this, straight there, finish. And the pressure comes straight with the elbow. So the moment that I feel I'm trying to attack, he's trying to block, I go here, look. Even over his hand, look. One, two, done. I close it, I begin like this. The hand gets behind his head, I lock the fist. Now my elbow drags, look. You see? So, and this works from anywhere, look. Boom, boom. As long as you get it, and when you go to finish, like every Ezekiel choke, you place your hand, when you turn to get behind his head, your palm has always to be facing outward, because this will prevent from your grip to break. Otherwise, you put pressure on your fingers, you will break your grip. So you gotta make sure, once you put it on, the hand is facing outward, this way, like that. You see, so even with his hands in, and, and be careful because if he puts the jaw, he may break his jaw. The pressure is so big here, he goes with the hand inside. Any way he tried to defend, it'd be very hard for him. Four fingers in, right there. And this move I started using when back then people were pulling the collar and locking with the armpit to prevent chokes. So it became very hard to finish here. So I would do right there. Move and finish. 